Hey you guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make these delicious chewy caramel candies from scratch using really simple ingredients. This is an old fashioned recipe that I know you're really going to love and they're way better than the ones you buy in the store. It's a pretty easy recipe but there are a couple of steps involved so let's get started. In a small saucepan measure out 2 cups of 35% cream. Now if you take your empty cream cartons and heat them gently for a few seconds on each side like this, the rest of the cream will come out. Now heat this to a lukewarm and set it aside. Now in a medium saucepan measure out 2 cups of sugar and 1 cup of corn syrup. Don't forget to oil that measuring cup first though. Now over medium heat stir this constantly until all the sugar dissolves and the mixture comes to a boil. But once it starts boiling, stop stirring it. This is when you're going to want to clip on a candy thermometer and you're going to want to cook the mixture to 250 degrees Fahrenheit or firmball stage. Now if you don't have a candy thermometer, just take a little bit of the mixture and drop it into some really cold water. If it forms a firm ball like this, it's done. That'll take about 5 minutes. Now you're going to want to start slowly adding that lukewarm cream bit by bit so the mixture never stops boiling. Don't worry if it boils like crazy at first. Just keep adding it until all the cream is gone and then you have to let it cook until it reaches 250 degrees again. This could take up to 30 minutes or even longer and even though the candy thermometer is reliable, the cold water test is the best way to be sure you're there. Now you'll want to start adding in half a cup of cubed butter the same way you added in the cream slowly bit by bit so the mixture never stops boiling like this. Keep doing that until all the butter is used up and then let it cook for another 2 minutes or so or until it reaches firm ball stage again. Remember to check with that cold water test if you don't have a candy thermometer. Then you can take it off the heat, remove the candy thermometer and now you'll want to stir in 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract. If you were using unsalted butter, now you'll want to add in 1 teaspoon of salt. I was using salted butter so I'm not going to bother. Now generously oil an 8 or 9 inch square pan and pour your caramel mixture into it. Scrape out as much of it as you can and now you have to let this sit for a few hours to set up. Then it's going to look like this. Now you can cut your caramels into as many squares as you want. I cut mine into 64. If you cook the caramel to a proper firm ball stage, your candies are going to have just the right texture. Now you're going to have to individually wrap each candy or they're going to stick together when you store them. You can just use wax paper or you can use fancy gold wrappers like this. So there you have it. I hope you try this recipe soon and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more awesome recipes and painting fun. Have a good day guys. Bye.